The .NET SAML Consumer add-on module enables custom-built non-standard .NET applications that do not currently support Federation to be converted quickly and easily to a SAML Federation supported application. This provides consumers with secure auth SSO access to applications that did not previously support Federation access, simplifying integration times while providing increased security and a better user experience during application access. In so doing, the .NET SAML consumer can increase security by utilizing SAML certificate validation and protocol security, eliminate unnecessary cookie data transfers and custom build authentications, thereby allowing for a standardization of architecture throughout your environment, Simplify the integration between SecureAuth IDP and the .NET form-based authentication supporting the application. And finally, allow for the application to live cross-domain from SecureAuth IDP. In this illustration, any number of outside computers can request access to applications through SecureAuth IDP. If the applications requested are compliant with the .NET framework standard, the .NET SAML Consumer VAM can interpret the applications and data into SAML. A typical use case for the .NET SAML Consumer is Company A's external collaborators or partners need to access Company B's on-premise portal resources securely and directly, thereby avoiding the need for clunky VPN connections. Typical integration points for this are the secure auth appliance via SAML and one or more portal applications being utilized by Company A's collaborators. Company A has multiple .NET applications that need central authentication, data store collaboration, two-factor authentication, audit logging, or other IDP functionality. This VAM allows for easy integration points for both the IDP and the service provider application. Deployment of the .NET SAML consumer VAM is simple, requiring two main steps. First, install the virtual directory by adding an application and configuring it as shown in this series of slides. Then configure SecureAuth SAML Consumer within SecureAuth IDP using the series of steps shown here. For more information on installing and configuring .NET SAML Consumer, refer to the .NET SAML Consumer Integration Guide. Once installed, the .NET SAML consumer can provide a secure auth environment identical to that experience for any other client of IDP. In this example, the .NET client signs in using a username and password, followed by a secure auth request for additional information. Then IDP requests a one-time code and asks for additional information, in this case a PIN code, and selection of a specific site before allowing access to the program or application. 